used to have competitors from all over travel here to play in the games. At least until the others ruined it. What happened? Hadrian and Mevia let power go to their heads. They started pitting people against each other, just for sport. Forcing people to be here. It isn't right. Come on, I'll show you where you'll be staying. Well, here it is, the competitor village, sort of a home away from home for all the people playing the games. Wait, are all of these people competitors? Yep, at least the ones who aren't stuck working in the quartz mines. Those poor souls are just waiting for their next shot. Mining is tough work. I feel bad for the people that are too scared or weak to play in the games. Wow, that's just horrible. I know. Mm. <laughs> they didn't make a deal like you did, Jesse. They're stuck here till they win the games. And what if they lose? Hadrian sends them to toil in the mines. If they're lucky, they'll get another shot at the games, but it might take a while. I'm gonna go confer with Otto. We go way back and, well, he's usually the most reasonable of the three. Wait, we still haven't found Lucas or Ivor. <sighs> I'm thinking that Hadrian must have sent them through the portal to the mines, which is technically against the rules. No one's supposed to go there until their whole team is eliminated. Huh, seems like Hadrian's trying to make sure we all know who's boss. You always did catch on quick. See what you can do here. I'm gonna try and find Otto. I've got confidence in you, Jesse. You might just get out of this. We gotta get our friends out of the mines quick. I'll go ask some of the other competitors. Um, hello? Don't you hello, face meat! Wait a minute, you're the cheater that blew up my friend, Slab! And face meat doesn't like cheaters. Don't stand around breathing up all of face meat's air. Face meat prefers dweeb free air. Do you know where my friends are? In the mines. Duh. And they're not going anywhere. Not on face meat's watch. That doesn't mean just stand there, staring at face meat. Please, pretty please let them go. Mm. Face meat knows not to let prisoners out. Oh, but giant eyes. Oh. Well, there is something you can do. Face meat was busy slamming mad revs at the gym and missed lunchtime. You see? So face meat's hungry. Do something about that, and face me think about getting your friends out. Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. Your stupid teammate killed Lucas. Yeah, I couldn't believe Nell pulled that off either. Don't forget they respawned, duh. Don't cry about it. We were doing what we had to do to win. Until you screwed up everything. Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long? So you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything. And they are completely under Hadrian's control. Good luck, Em. I know that the best person will win. Seriously? You know you're looking at the best person. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. Have you ever won the games? Yeah, I won, but I decided to give up the prize of going home to stay in this awesome place longer. 
Of course I haven't won. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. before I see if I can attach this sign to your head. <laughs> it's so nice when new contestants are in the village. Would it be possible for me to uh, have some of that bread? It's for that guy over there. Seriously? I'm not falling for that. No bread until lunchtime. Get out of here before I make you into a meal. Does anyone have any food I can borrow or will have? I guess I should ask around. Whoa, it's you from Spleef. You were like amazing. I know. <laughs> And I am so super sorry about your friend. I get your prompts upset, especially since you had no idea what was going on. <laughs> Speaking of my friends, have you seen them lately? Nope, sorry. They're like probably in the mines, and that's on me. Such bad karma, bad karma. I will never do that to one of your friends again because man, I do not want to be on your bad side I gotta say you keep playing like that and you'll be like Tim status Tim who Tim like the legend of Tim Tim on the signs like one okay like you could people could like already be talking they're gonna like say stuff compare you to Tim it might be a little uncomfortable. Or not. It's cool. I'm not here to be a Tim. I just want to get home. But that's like exactly what makes you Tim status. Tim didn't want to be Tim either. He got his whole team home. Listen, I still feel super bad about taking out your friend. I owe you. So if you ever need anything, you just come and ask, shall? No, I mean, seriously. I mean, anything at all. Like, I want to help out people. Well, actually, I'm trying to bribe that guard. Face me. And he's hungry. Well, um, if I had some wheat, I would totally give you some. Sadly, I don't have a secret stash. And if you didn't ask, I wouldn't loan you some. Wink. Come on, quick before anybody sees us. That should be enough for your bread. All of it? Of course, brah. It'll grow back. Just, uh, leave the seeds, yeah? One. Planting as I go. And that's another. <laughs> Sweet! And that should all grow back soon. Nice! Looks like that should be enough for some epic loafage. Yeah, that means bread. Hopefully bread will be enough to get that face meat guy to help me. Righteous. They don't let us use crafting tables, though. Then I guess I'll just have to make my own. Where can I get some wood planks? Hey, I remember a bunch of, like, wood planks by the dojo. I think they train by, like, punching them or whatever, you know? Thank you, Nell. Hey, no problem. Happy to help. Catch you later, yeah?
wooden plank solid. There, that should be enough for a table. Aha! That's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. Um, hello? Hey, face me. Got some bread for you. Bread, huh? Hm. It's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mm, it's so warm. Oh, and full of carbs. Please get my friends. <laughs> face meat appreciates the politeness. Hang on. Hey, Petra. Hey, glad to see you already figured out the whole nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, nice. It seems like we keep ending up in situations. Back with Palma, you picked Lucas, and so today in that stupid game, I worried. Well, what I'm trying to say is, thanks. You know, don't make this awkward. I did what I had to do. Well... I appreciate it. I'm glad you're with me in this, Petra. Me too. Here. Go on, oh! sponsor. Jesse. Man, is it good to see you. You too, Lucas. And Ivor. Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Shut up. My outfit breathes wonderfully. Anyway, how's it been going out here? You, uh... You don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary! Sorry. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. Don't worry, we're just in this tournament where if we win, we get the Atlas and our ticket home. Oh, well that's better than I thought. But if we lose, we'll be mining for quartz forever. Nope. That is not a thing I want. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> it's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just uh, stare at you while you mine. Lucas, we need the Atlas to get home. <sighs> I know. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Oh, great. What do you two want? Hey, now. Otto just wanted to meet you. Don't be mad. Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting, you being here. I can feel change in the air. Great, as long as I get to go home. That is the point, but you have to win first. And my job is to make sure everybody, even Hadrian, plays by the rules. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. 
Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Ah, oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I wonder what the next event will be. Hopefully nothing too deadly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. Wonderfully! Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the games. And it's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in sleep, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh, I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course about our plucky newcomers. Shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there. <laughs> Wonder how this is gonna go. These other losers don't look so tough. Oh my gosh, I'm so sick of these pompous jerks. Yeah, I'm right there with you. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? A race! We've totally got this! <laughs> got this, huh? Boom! Surprise locker room visit! Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian! And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. I'm not gonna be in your twisted interview, Hadrian. Get out of my face. Oh, I'll get out of your face. But I'll be laughing at your face from my nice cushy box while I watch you burn. Oh, I promise you that, you little nothing. Listen up, bucko. These are supposed to be games. These are supposed to be fun. So play along. I sincerely hope that we understand each other. I'm through talking, Hadrian. Let's just get this over with. Oh, you are just really pushing my buttons now. Watching you burn is gonna be extra satisfying. <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but, uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? Oh, Em, glad to see my charms finally wore you down. Well, I was thinking about how you handled Spleef, and then you made that deal with the old builders, and I thought, an enemy of my enemy is my friend. Whoa, that means Em wants to be, like, friends with you, Jesse. Whoa! M might be up to something. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? I could use an ally. And you could use my help. <sighs> Come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. How can I trust you? You can trust me. Or you can take a slab to the face. <laughs> you got a point. In the middle of the race is a part with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean, that's okay too. You got a deal. Good. I won't let you down. Competitors, to the starting line. Meet you at Gladiator Junction. Gladiator Junction? That sounds awesome. At least we won't have to fight her and the gladiators. I'm ready for this. Those gladiators are going down. Hint, it's gonna involve a lot of punching and kicking and all around awesomeness. Let's play it safe. Hadrian might have something else planned. You got it, Jesse. I don't trust him as far as I can throw him, which is pretty far for the record.
Jesse, I just like wanted to say it's like an honor to be working together. And I'm glad that M like totally suggested that. We can do this. Uh, yeah. I knew that you were cool from the moment we met. Competitors, on your mark. Get set. Go! Did it. This has been pretty tough. Can't wait to see what else they throw at us. This is gonna be easy. That's what you think. Huh? Out of the way, chumps! Sounds like this is Gladiator Junction, but where are the gladiators? My body! Whoa! That answers that question. for the fun part. I sure hope so. Come on, man. Glad she's with us, Jesse. You're mine. I've been dreaming about this since sleep. Oh, yeah, Slab? Because you seem pretty outnumbered. Just being more fun for me. We'll see about that. Right, Em? Em? <laughs> Fine, squishy. What? Jesse, got your back. Go! Go! Looks like you're all alone yeah, now. That's math. Tired of you, Slab. I was just thinking the same thing about you. I could do this. Sorry, now I'm winning this thing. Hey, whoa, whoa, Jesse. Way to catch up, dude. Very nice. You just can't take a hit, can you? Get huh? dunked on, whoa, whoa, slacker. Hang on. How are we gonna get out of here? 
Oh, the water, little dude. And ride that wave right back up to the top. Follow me. For you? Thanks for saving me. Yeah, I don't mention it. This race is almost over, and we will soon have a winner. And I think I know who it might be. I am the winner of the lava race, the gladiator, formerly known as Emily. I trust you made good on our deal. I did. If that's true. Then why hasn't Jesse respawned yet? Jesse. And there appears to be a confrontation on the field. Bet you didn't think you'd see me here, did you? This just went from bad to worse. So you sacrificed winning the race to save someone else. Good to know. And you? You were supposed to eliminate Jesse. Our deal's off. Deal? No, 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 please. You probably think I'm scum or whatever, but you know what? I don't even care. You have your deal, Jesse. If you win, you and your friends will just leave us anyway. My shot at going home just went up in smoke. So feel free to judge all you want. Hard to hurt me any more than Hadrian did just now. Whatever, you're a liar. Why should I waste my time talking to you? Ugh, fine. Okay, respawning is the worst. You. Hadrian wants you. Hadrian? Why does he want to see me? You made him real mad. Come on. I don't have all day. I'm warning you, Jesse. And are you mad, too? Mad I didn't get eliminated? No. No? Because you seem mad. Yeah, okay, fine. I'm mad that he wouldn't let me kill you a few times before I brought you upstairs. And you should know I asked. Come on. No. Just Jesse. <sighs> Hadrian doesn't allow dirty respawns in the palace. Okay. Well, be safe, Jesse. I don't trust them. Hmm. Hey, psst. I need to talk to you. Keep up. Come on. Come here. It'll be quick. Jesse, you gonna do what I say or not? Hey, Jesse. Yeah, over here. Jesse, I'm warning you. I think you're gonna wait for me, lackey. I mean, what are you gonna do? Kill me? Oh, wait, I forgot you can't. Hey, what's up? Hi, Jesse, I'm Sebastian. Um, I know you're about to see the old builders, and I just wanted to say, please, just don't make them mad. Whatever they want you to do, just do it. It is way worse for us when they're mad. We're just happy you're here. I know, you're so busy. Of course, Sebastian, I'm always happy to help out. Then please keep helping us. It's so much nicer around here when they aren't mad. We sometimes get cake. I don't want to keep you, but some of the miners and I, well, we made you something. I know it's not much, but it's all we have. Wow, thank you. You didn't have to do this. Jesse, come on! Now we're going to be late and I'm going to get in trouble. Just the most not cool. Yeah, sorry about that. I just really wanted to hear what that guy had to say. Whatever. 